In this lecture, I'm going to talk about test coverage and summary of white box testing. First, I'm going to talk about this Java Core Coverage tool. You can go to Lips website for more information. Here are different tools that you can study. And in my example, I will show you Eclipse, JUnit, JarCoco, and the Eclipse Emma. This is a good combination for Eclipse for test and test coverage. What is core coverage? Core coverage, in short, is all about how thoroughly your tests exercise your code base. The intent of test, of course, is to verify that your code does what it's expected to, but also to document what the code is expected to do. Take further, core coverage can be considered as an indirect measure of quality. Indirect because we are talking about the degree to what our test cover our code, or simply the quality of test. The other word core coverage is not about verifying the end product's quality, but the quality of the test. Measures, how you measure the success for the coverage. Statement coverage, statement coverage, also known as line coverage, is a measure which indicates the degree to which individual statements are getting executed during test execution. Majors, decision covers. Decision covers is a major based on whether decision points such as if and the while statement evaluate to both true and the false during the test execution, thus causing both execution paths to be exercised. Decision coverage is also relative simple, which is both its pole and its cons. The downside is that the major doesn't take into consideration how the Boolean value was gotten, whether a logic OR was short circuit or not. For example, leaving whatever code was in the later parts of the statement unexecuted. Major variance for decision coverage. The deficit of the decision coverage major is tackled to some degree by condition coverage. Pass coverage represents yet another interesting major. Pass coverage measures whether each possible pass from start to finish is covered. So condition coverage and the pass coverage are more details coverage than the decision coverage. But these are variants for decision coverage. Function coverage. Function coverage is a measure for verifying that each function is invoked during test execution. In all its simplicity, function coverage is a very easy way to spot the biggest gaps in your core coverage. We have mentioned this brute force monitor as one way we find the pass coverage, but this is not very practical. Information collected at monitor no ID number, timestamp, choice, how many visits you have. Proof force method can only be used for debugging mode, not even integration mode. For integration mode and release mode, tools are suggested. Eclipse plus JUnion, Jacoco, Eclipse Emma. Here is one report. I got it from internet. And if you are interested, you should come here for installation. Coverage report. The coverage report view show or analyze the Java element within the common Java hierarchy. Individual column contains the following numbers for the active session, always summarizing the child element of the respective Java element. Coverage ratio, items covered, items not covered, total items. Installation of Eclipse Emma and how to use it, go Eclipse. I have shown you those concepts about coverage, but right now let me show you the tool. First, to install it, go help and then Eclipse Marketplace. And right here, put your cursor on the find and then type ECL Emma and then search. And right here, I have already installed it. 
If you want to install, there will be install mark. Click install and you will be able to install it. You need to check some agreement or something, but that installation is very simple. Let's look at our environment. So right here, I have one program, the GPA normal.java in previous lecture. Let me click back to the console. Here is its execution result. So if you click coverage after installation of Eclipse Emma, you should be able to see something like this. Here are different module and its coverage and the number of code covered and total instructions, something like that. And if you look at this GPN normal, the Java, I have already run it. It's 100% totally coverage. So let us try to run this GPA run corners that Java. Click coverage. So let's pull down. Let's try to find it. GPA run corners. Right here is a purple. I said this purple. This purple one is uh, uncovered because this is wrong. Let, let me try to find some good one. Now let's try to have different wrong. Let's try to have the GPA wrong corner, the Java. In order to run it with the coverage report, you need to click this file, not open that file to be highlighted. And then right here, you can see here is a button launch, GPA wrong corner. And this one actually is for the coverage. Here is a little red box over there. Go. And then it finished the run. Let me open it and source. Say unit test concept. Right here, the GPA run corner is hundred percent covered. And if you look back to the file GPA normal, in that run it's not covered because that's a single run report. The previous run have been reset. If we click this, uh, if we click this blank account test Java, click the same launch key. It's down, go down, and then click here. We need to find the blank account test Java. Right here, this is blank account test Java. It is 97.4. So there are five lines of code not covered. Come back to look at your program. The blue one I set up is covered and the purple one is uncovered. If you want to change the color, click here. It's a preference and then you go to general and go editor, text editor. And there is annotations and come here. You can change the full coverage. Currently I use a uh, blue for covered. And then no coverage for purple. Let's change the color. You, you will see. So let me change it to this cardinal color. And then click OK. See? The untested part become cardinal. So just right click. And then click preference. And then you check general. And editor. Go to text editor. And then annotation. And then go to this... Uh, no coverage. For full coverage, you change the click the full coverage. For no coverage, you click the no coverage. And I change it back to purple. Click OK. And click OK here. OK. Try yourself and have some fun. Thank you.